What's up guys? Brian and Michael here, uh, making a, another video for you. Uh, guard retention. We've worked about guard retention and like turtle attacks. Those are things I think that are pretty linked together. Um, and then too, you know, if your turtle attacks go wrong, we've been working some back defense. Right? So t I'm saying turtle like you're on bottom. So we do a couple of uh, guard retention techniques. And um, one thing I want to highlight before we get started is like, a lot of times you go into Jiu Jitsu Academy and you see people like doing warm ups where they are doing like the S legs, right? There's an S mount, do, uh, it's like this in the Omoplata. We do these hip walkers and different, different warm ups where our legs are like that, okay? That, that's going to kind of become a feature in a couple of the finishes that, uh, that we're going to show here, okay? So, <clears throat> Michael's going to hop up and look, so he may get the inside paint grip. Some people like to do this like here. Some people like to do it on the insides of the ankles and some people like to do it on the knees. Yeah, you know, it all sounds good to me. So I don't have any pants, none of it works really well. Neither does this double sleeve grip guard retention I'm about to show you, but whatever. Right? If you do have these on, you're doing Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, uh, uh, you know, you can do it. No E, I do different stuff. We'll look back for some stiff arm videos later. Okay, so this, he's gonna pass to his left, my right. Okay, when that happens, look, I get my shoulders in line and I put my hand on the mat and I kind of stiff arm there, which is punching his sleeve, and I'm here. Okay, now if he passes to the other way, right there. So this is just a way that I've had my guard pass many times. My, I'm not going to really do anything. Just go ahead and do like an X pass or just some sort of standing pass you like to do. Like, yeah, just like that. Like many times I've been in this situation. You know what I'm saying? Where like I didn't have a grip, but they just passed the guard, you know? So a drill you can do is when he goes to pass, okay, the side he passes on, keep the sleeve, and I kind of strip it, and I use my hip escape. Very basic, okay? So that's a drill, work it in the academy. Here's a little um, finishing option, right? This is like a throw in judo called sode sokome gosh, okay? It, it means um, uh, sleeve, uh, lift, pull, shoulder throw, I think. Yeah, something like that, lift, pull, hip throw. It's kind of like a Sayanagi, it's kind of like a hip throw. There's arguments about that in judo, not to get into all that. but. Here's the thing. People are like, oh, I can't remember which hand to put down. Maybe there's not a wrong hand to put down. We are grabbing people's pajamas, okay? So just keep an open mind. He, he goes to pass, and you say you forgot. Don't let go at all. Here. I can throw the dude's hand so he can slap. If you do this from standing, you really want to do that from there. <laughs> like he and I, we did a video of a standing version of a throw similar to this where like, I toss his hand to the mat because, you know, it's sort of like compounded. And two, he almost, his arms get crossed really strangely here. Um, so watch out for your training partner so you keep your training partner. It's a big thing in the academy. You know, you want your people to come back and train with you. Okay, so here he goes to pass. Boom. Right here. And toss that sleeve to the mat. And what's, what I like about this, guys, is I come from this knee up position, I throw him over, and I come up to my knees like this. So just like a little warm up move that we've been doing is going from the S legs to the sitting position, to the S legs, to guard. That's how we kind of sit up, sweep, and so on. Okay, so that's just a couple good options, guys. Work on your guard retention. Don't let somebody pass your guard. And if you pass somebody's guard, don't let them get it back. It'll make everything funner. All right. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you.